We are very excited about our next guest. She is five-time Grammy winner. Did you hear that? Five times. Grammy winner Faith Hill. She is one of the country music's most successful artists. Thank you very much. Hill is also a talented actress, and she stars in the mega-hit Yellowstone prequel 1883, and she's knockout in it. She and her husband, that would be Tim McGraw, play James and Margaret Dutton. They are the great-grandparents of John Dutton of Yellowstone, who was portrayed by Kevin Costner. You know that. So in 1883, it follows the Dutton family's dangerous journey west across the plains to a better life. In this clip, Margaret talks to her daughter, Elsa, while they're in a river about why there's no such thing as freedom. I don't know what life is like in Oregon, but there'll be rules there, too. This trail is as free as you'll ever be. The only rules you need to follow are the ones in your heart. Yeah, 1883 is on the Viacom CBS streaming service, Paramount Plus. First on CBS Mornings, guess who's here in the studio? Faith Hill! <laughs> we so, we've been Hi. waiting for you all day, Faith. Thank you. So, so let's talk about 1883 you. because, number one, you play a real gritty girl, and you like being a gritty girl, it seems. Oh, yes, I'm a gritty girl. I'm from Mississippi, so... No, I no. grew up in the dirt. <laughs> no, no, because I literally said, Faith, you're driving a wagon in this series. And she says to me, have you ever driven a wagon? I go, look at me, Faith. I look like you've driven a wagon. But you a G-Wagon. Yeah, a G-Wagon. <laughs> <laughs> That's very really well played good. and very true. Okay. And then Faith. I asked you, I said, why don't we go on a road trip in a wagon? Yes, I would like that. Groovy music. I would like to go with you. in a wagon. That'd be amazing. But you were saying this is the hardest thing that you guys have done. How come? Oh, wow. Well, uh, Physically, the, the hardest thing we've done. Mm -hmm. And for Tim to say that, for those of you who know Tim, my, my husband, he is uh, physically, he's in shape. Mm -hmm. And he can handle everything. As are you. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah, thank you. But unlike him, it, it, for him to say that, the most physically challenging thing that he's ever done, me as well, mentally as well, it was just, I mean, to be... Uh, real and authentic in that time period. Um, Taylor, want, Taylor Sheridan, Sheridan. Uh, wanted us to really dive in, do a deep dive and just be it, live it. <laughs> and we did. It's your first time together, too, as husband and wife. Yeah. What was the conversation leading up to? Should we do it? Should we not? Were you nervous about doing it? Um, we, we really didn't question doing it after we read the script Ooh. because it was so remarkable yeah. and is so remarkable. Uh, it was just the fact that we had the time to do it, which is also rare that we're, we're both available. The stars lined up and it was just a chance and opportunity we couldn't pass up. Yeah. Do you think it helped or hurt being a real life married couple playing this couple? Um, I think that uh, it, 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 it was a benefit to us as well, um, it, uh, for sure. I, I think someone who could have done, you know, I mean, it was a benefit, mm -hmm. I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we but, used it as a benefit. We've been married for 25 years. The thing that we chose to do is uh, we decided not to rehearse together. Why is that? Ever. Well, because we're together all the time. Mm -hmm. We have three daughters, been married for 25 years. Yeah. We thought, okay, the spontaneity is going to be created and the moment that we, you know, set foot on set. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, Tim is James and, and I'm Margaret, and that's who we are, and let's, that's where we, we become them, is on that set and not at home. <laughs> this couple is literally fighting to survive. Yes. Um, yeah. Do you find any parallels, not just with your character, but maybe your marriage? Fighting to survive? No, I haven't thought about that. I hope not. <laughs> no, I mean, just the, the, the characters individually, do, do you find any parallels between who you play and who your husband plays? Well, I think as a parent, as a, for everyone that's on the show, with, you know, immigrants, mm -hmm. all of us, um, all the actors, we're fighting to survive. Yeah. And I think the, the thing that is um, a reminder is when you have a family and you take them 
you have a dream and you take them someplace that you really have no, you've never been. Mm -hmm. You can't just dial it up the on unknown. a computer yeah. and say, oh, we want to go there. That looks amazing. Yeah. We have this it, picture of you. I'm oh, sorry. Oh, no, go ahead. Go ahead. Well, I was going to say, like, we have this picture of you driving the wagon, as Gail said at the top. You actually had to learn how to do that. And I'm, Oh, yeah. And I'm curious, do you think, 1883 is, uh, on the one hand, a long time ago, <laughs> but also not a long time ago, right? So yeah, that's right. So do you think you could have made that kind of journey once upon a time? Um, I have. Yes, oh, you can. I, I could have. Yeah. I mean, I, I pray I could have. But I tell you what, it, it pushes the limits of your character, of uh, the things that you think that are impossible that you would never be able to do or pull off or survive, you, I mean, you do. Yeah, yeah. Because it is truly about And survival. you're a Mississippi girl. Yes! yes. Tough you, as they you, come. You, That's you right! You but can I talk about you and Rita Wilson? Woo! That's a funny thing, but you and Rita, <laughs> you and Rita get to act together and you're very good friends. Yes. What was that like, Faith? Because it was fun to see the two of you on the screen. You were, uh, you were drinking whiskey punch. And it looked like both of you gotten a little tipsy, but it was so fun to watch the two of you together. <laughs> <laughs> it was, um, thank, it, we had the, be the best time. Honestly, I, I went to the director and I said, I am so excited, I can't tell you. This is gonna be the best day of filming ever. <laughs> but I just wanna warn you that I don't know if we're gonna get anything because we're gonna <laughs> laugh the entire time. That's all we do when we're together. Yeah. I mean, obviously we have a deep relationship, but um, it, we had a good time. Yeah. What do you like about playing Margaret though? What do you like about her? She's a very strong character and it's fun to watch you embody her too, to me. Oh, thank you. Well, I mean that. Um, I, she's just, she's, uh, she's strong, you know? She's strong, but she's also dealing with a lot of things as many people and women did during that time and and to this day you're you have a, a you know my husband is a dreamer and i want to believe in him mm. and i also want to uh, i want my children to know that i i trust what your dad is doing right. and 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 we are going to follow him then we have amazing daughter mm -hmm. um isabel may played by isabel may who is an incredible actor and Audie, who is our young son, uh, you know, you're trying to, he's young. Isabel is just a, she, she just goes wild and free. Yeah. Well, it's and, great and, to see the two yeah. of you together on screen. And little known fact, Faith Hill and Tim McGraw actually like to do road trips. <laughs> we do. Driving their own SUV, pumping their own gas. That's yeah. Pumping right. their own gas. That's right. Don't That's be surprised right. at a gas station near you. Yep. Faith Hill, thank you. <laughs> thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Gorgeous continued success. Great thank you. Great show. Thank you. You can see more of Faith Hill tonight. Oh, you're on the Stephen Colbert tonight. Oh, oh yes. Okay. Yeah. Right here on CBS. <laughs> and I didn't know that. And you can watch new episodes of 1883 every Sunday on Paramount+. <laughs>